All right, the rides are back. Cliffs Amusement Park closed its gates back in 2019. Feels like forever ago. And back then, we certainly never could have thought it would be this long before we could see people riding those roller coasters again. But it's back open, and folks are excited. Brittany Costello takes us inside the sold out park. Well, if there is something good about COVID, it's these capacity limits. Not for those of you who couldn't get in today, but when it comes to these lines, the weather is perfect, the lines are shorter, and people are really excited to get back to normal, at least somewhat. It is a rush. Many people have waited and waited to get back. There's a part where it goes really up and it, uh, it gets me down really fast. Now that opening day is here. How many times are you guys going to ride it? 7,000 probably. People can't get enough. I'm surprised there's not too many people. I was, I thought it'd be more packed. That's part of the appeal. If you do get a ride pass, there is plenty of park for everyone. The lines are pretty chill. Um, when we went on the first, there was about no one there, and we were all worried because we didn't know if they were closed or not. The key is getting your hands on some tickets. Yeah, we got them before online. And, and how, how far in advance? Uh, as soon as I heard they were going to open. While the games aren't operating right now, plenty of fan favorites are. There's this pirate ship one that goes up and down. It's a tasty reminder of what's to come. A summer similar to what we remember. One with friends, family, and celebrations. Happy birthday, Jacob! They are sold out here this first weekend, and due to the capacity limits, they will continue to operate through those online reservations. Reporting at Cliffs, Brittany Costello, KOB4.